Okay, turo ko po sa inyo yung basic ng paggamit ng StreamYard. Lalo na sa inyo pag live stream sa Facebook or sa YouTube. Una sa lahat, punta muna tayo sa StreamYard.com and login po tayo gamit ang ating Gmail. Click po natin dito, login with Google. And then, piliin po natin yung Gmail na available, which is ito po. Okay, ito na po yung pinaka-dashboard po natin sa StreamYard. So, in order for us to start a live stream, click here sa button na ito. Then, select live stream. Tapos, pipili tayo ngayon ng platform. So, add destination. Gamit po tayo ng Facebook page. Then, click on connect Facebook. So, for this one, gamitin ko po yung aking page. Then, next and save. Tapos, maglagay po tayo ngayon ng title. For example, let's have live stream. For the description, pwede namang i-copy-paste lang po yan. Or you can add your own description. Then, click on create broadcast. So, click po natin itong allow mic and cam access. Click on allow. So, for our microphone and camera settings, click on settings. Let's change our camera. Ayan. Then, for our audio, let's have microphone. For kung ano po yung microphone na gamit po ninyo. Then, close this one. So, for the display name, on enter studio. So, close lang natin to. So, ito po yung pinaka-screen po natin. Ito po yung may kita sa ating live stream. So, let's add our camera. Ayan. Next is, check po natin dito sa right side. Okay? So, andito yung go live. Dito yung comments, banners, brand, and private chat. So, private chat, nagagamit lamang po yan kapag may kasama ka po guest dito sa ating stream yan. So, you can invite some guests. Ibigay nyo lang po itong link na ito. At hindi po makikita yung chat ninyo kapag naka-livestream. So, kayo kayo lang na nandito ang makakabasa ng private chat. Next is brand. So, brand, pwede natin i-edit dito. You can edit this brand. You can rename the brand, for example. Then, next and say livestream. Rename brand. So, nice to have lang po yan. You can change the brand color. For example, let's have green. You can change the theme. So, we have minimal and block. The other one is classic. You can show and display names. Also, show headlines. So, we have our headlines here, pero hindi na natin kailangan yan. Close natin. For this basic feature, hindi po natin pwedeng tanggalin ang logo. Okay? Once you add logo, kailangan natin i-upgrade. Okay? So, hindi po natin yung papalitan. Also, we can add our video clips. Let's add another videos. So, pala tayo sa videos. For example, let's have this one, timer, open. So, pwede nyo nang i-play yan. So, you can add more videos if you want to. Next is banner. Okay? So, for banners, uh, delete na po natin ito by clicking here, delete, and delete this one. So, let's create a banner. Tapos, mag-type po tayo. For example, live stream. Click on add banner. So, once you click on show, ayan po yung mangyayari. You can hide that also. Let's add another banner. Then, click po natin itong scroll across bottom clicker. Add banner. So, once na-show po natin yan, ito yung tura. Okay, for the comments naman, once na naka-live na po kayo, pwede na kayong pumili dyan ng mga comments na pwede nyo i-show si screen. For example, this one. Nalabas po si screen mismo kapag kinilig po natin yung show. Then, also, you can hide it. Yan. Then, you can now start going live. Just click here sa go live. Then, click on go live. Ayan, naka-live na tayo. So, you can check here sa ating upper left corner. Papasin nyo dyan na meron na pong time. The same time, number of viewers pag meron na pong nanonood ng live stream po ninyo. Then, in order to end the broadcast, click here sa end broadcast. At dyan, nagtatapos ang ating basic tutorial sa paggamit po ng stream yard sa inyong pag-live stream, sa inyong Facebook, YouTube channel, and any different Thank you so much for watching and God bless you.